Hi everyone, my name is Alex. Today we'll be trying the Remedy for Dry Lips. This product retails for $16. This is the final product from the new skincare line from Dr. Shaw that I am trying called Remedy and it is their lip balm. He made a video talking about how this was their most popular product and I am so excited to try it because it seems to have amazing ingredients in it that have worked great for me in some other lip balms that I have tried. This is also very affordable and fragrance free. It's rare to find a lip balm that is fragrance free because they load them with so many fragrant ingredients. It's never been an issue with me, but some people are sensitive to it. So I am glad we have options like this on the market. This product is vegan, cruelty-free, fragrance-free, alcohol-free, and comes in recyclable packaging. The highlight ingredients in this product include ceramides, squalene, and peptides, but they also include petrolatum, dimethicone, and shea butter. The ingredients in this product just keep going on and on. Check out the full ingredient list. Make sure you click the link in the description go to their website. The main things I'll be looking for with this product mainly include how long lasting is it, what type of nourishment does it deliver to my lips, and also how often do I feel like I need to reapply it. I also always test with lip balms to see if I can use them overnight, so that will be the big things I'll be looking for with this product. As for anything else, I'll be continuing to do check-ins, so I will see you all in the next check-in. Hi everyone, I'm here to give you all a quick check-in on this lip balm. So far, I have been using it for a few days. It seems to be pretty long lasting and it leaves a very natural feel finish on the lips. First of all, you do get a standard amount with this, which is 10 ml. And it has a thick kind of balmy texture. I'm gonna see if I can show you. Like it's extremely lightweight, but it's not sticky and it kind of just leaves a nice lightweight, like almost not even there finish. I'll better show you on the lips. What I love about it is it provides an instant soothing benefit to the lips. My lips were so dry before using this and it kind of instantly calms that. But you can see there's practically no finish on it if I rub it in. But don't let that lightweight finish fool you because it does pack a punch when it comes to hydration. This is a very nourishing lip treatment. It does last a long time. It all depends on what you're doing. Obviously, if you eat right after you apply it, then it's not gonna last. But I noticed that applying this right before bed, I do a thick layer, it kind of hydrates my lips and leaves me waking up with nourished lips. I love using it during the day as well. This is a beautiful product and I'm really impressed with it so far. So I'm gonna continue using it, seeing what else I notice, and then I'll check it again. Hi everyone, I'm back to give you all my final thoughts on this lip balm. This is a very impressive product, and I love the amount of ingredients that they had in it that were designed to hydrate and also lock in hydration to the lips. This product was very well-rounded, meaning I do feel like it lasted a long time while also being extremely lightweight for the lips. It was very nourishing and was very simple and honestly a great fragrance-free option in my opinion. I feel like it showed better results the more I continued using it. And so for that reason, I would recommend trying it. It is also very affordable. And currently at the time of filming this, it is sold out as well. This product is very impressive. And just like all the other products from the Remedy line have been very impressive so far. I'm loving my results that I'm seeing with them. And this product is no different. It's a very simple lip balm. It's to the point, it's fragrance free. So if you are sensitive to fragrance, I would recommend going for this this option because that is rare with a lot of other lip products and it's just an amazing product overall. I really cannot recommend it enough and it provided a long lasting nourishing hydration to the lips and I found that I was having to reapply it less the more that I was using it. As for using it overnight, it did work well if I applied a thicker layer of it. I feel like this product is very well rounded and an amazing hydrating lip treatment. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it and you want to see more like this, make sure you subscribe because I post new videos every week and I will see you all in the next review.